Hey guys, how are you? So Esther here and Tom is still MIA. <laughs> so we're gonna continue this series and actually it's perfect because the title of this video is uh, how do you manage your level of crazy when dealing with self-care timeout so that you can be the best support you can for others? And so let's talk about this. So as you can see, first of all, it's such a beautiful area here and uh, it's just lovely. Um, so let's talk about this. So self-care and timeout. So, you know, this is a very important topic and I think it can be very misunderstood in our society today because a lot of people may think um, it's all about self, meaning, uh, you know, I have to care about myself, I have to worry about myself, I, it's all about me, 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 and all of that. And so, yes, on some level that is true. We have to take care of ourselves and we have to make sure that we have self-preservation and, and all of that and you know and it's all very very important and it's not to put that away but let's unpack it for a second um we have to learn that our fulfillment let's let's take this up a notch and go spiritual for a second when we're talking about fulfillment when we're talking about true happiness what I found, and many others who are on the same path as myself, have found, oh, the sun is giving us uh, a beautiful confirmation here, if you like to take it that way, um, is that it's really about us and it's really not about us. It's about us in the sense that it is our path, it is our tests, it is our growth, it is for us to learn and break and clean up our karma here but we do that through the process of being there for others. And so if you can really tap into what that means, and for those of you that do, you know what I'm talking about. And for those of you that are kind of struggling to understand, it's really the process of being completely in service, being a person that is totally a servant of the world. You know, really giving yourself over to other people in your life, giving people over to like maybe an organization, and then you wanna you wanna con you know contribute your time there. You wanna serve. You wanna share. You wanna volunteer. Maybe you work for this organization and you give all of yourself to this career, to this job. And so, when we talk about self care and time out, when you're doing those things you need to make sure that you're taking care of yourself so that you can continue to be a great powerhouse for these things that you're doing. So that means come out into nature. Look at this beautifulness, right? Come out into nature, spend some time on your own, you know, being with nature, being with the little creatures that are out here, not too close, because if they bite, that might be a problem. <laughs> so, um, but uh, you know, coming out into nature, making some time for yourself so that you can continue to give back in a really big and powerful way when you are giving and serving to whether it's your family members, your spouse, your partner, whatever, the organization you work for. So, you know, it's a very powerful message. It's a powerful thing to, to understand and to know. And it's powerful to be able to carve that time out because sometimes I know for myself, sometimes I feel bad, you know, wanting to, uh, you know, leave for a few, for, for a bit and do my own thing and this and that, but I'm learning, I'm learning to create those boundaries. I'm learning to create that space. I'm learning to say, Hey, I got to go do this and I go do it. <clears throat> and when I come back, I'm able to come back with so much more power and energy and intensity uh, from a good space, you know, and I'm able to be a much bigger and better partner uh, on all levels, whether it's, you know, at, my, at, our, at our clinic or with my family or with Tom or whatever. So with that, guys, I hope that this message inspires you to get some time out so that you can come back and be the ultimate greatest support for those around you. And uh, if not, 
so let be, right? <laughs> anyway, um, thank you so much for always su your support. And uh, I promise Tom will be back soon. But, uh, but these, are, these are nice. These are nice. It's nice to spend some time with just me and you again. Because I used to do this back in the day. So this is nice. All right, guys. So it's been a pleasure. It's been lovely sharing this time with you. And uh, as always, I'll share his, uh, his quotes with you. So when you know, in a, uh, sorry, let's do Tom's quotes first. So when, what you resist persists. When you know better, you do better. And you know, we have to reveal things to heal them. So don't be afraid when things come up. And uh, when you know and understand yourself, the world will know and understand you too. And what's the best that can happen? Okay, guys, thank you so much. Take care. See you soon.